all the riders. Competition day begins with hope, nerves, and lots of boot polish. It takes technique to polish your boots. I, I'm just buffing my boots. Again. But everyone also knows at the end of the day, most will go home in tears. This day is awful, I hate it. Just because, you know, you're working for something that you want pretty bad. You're just gonna jump a few this morning. When you're ready 55 riders will compete here today, but only 22 will continue on to the finals. Even top teams like Brian and Logan are feeling the strain. This is our final school before the regionals today. Brian is wanting the weekend to go well. Yesterday was one of her worst show days in a while. I think she's feeling a little bit the pressure. Brian, why don't you just start to canter and jump and not make him crazy? Brian and Logan can't afford a repeat of yesterday's disastrous round. If they can't work it out, Brian's dream of being the first person in history to win all four national championships will end today. Here, come here a second. You're indoors, you're thinking you don't need more control than you really need, and you start button heads against him. Uh, and yeah. he's got a temper. Just give him a nice loose rein, let him go his way, and once we get him a little quieter, he'll purr for it. He'll be a sports psychologist in this game. It's not just a not just a horse trainer and a horse a horseman that's making sure the horses are getting the best care. But you've got to be a psychologist with the kids, a psychologist with the parents, and you know, calm them down without getting anxious and excited yourself. Luckily, Frank has an idea of how to get his star team back in top form. So by working him a little bit on the lunge line, we're slowing his mind down a little bit. Oh God, my saddle, oh. Frank thinks Logan has some extra energy he needs to burn off, which will help calm down both him and Brian. If somebody loves to play soccer, and you let him go outside and play soccer, and have fun for half an hour, an hour, they're gonna be in a much better frame of mind to come into the classroom and study. Hopefully, Logan's study break will pay off because the real competition is about to begin. I'm freaking out. Frank has eight riders showing today, but rival Barn Heritage Farm also has a couple girls in today's competition. And head trainer Andre Dignelli is determined to give Beacon Hill a run for their money. And then don't feel like you're panicked, you know, just a nice rhythm, stay out. Riders, you know, it, it's... And Frank always loves a good rivalry. She jumps as possible, just the way she is, and I think other riders may want to jump a hundred more. Well, you know, Andre thinks he gets away with everything, but, you know, there's always people watching. Every time I look around, I hear you talking about me. Someone needs to tell Andre that skinny look is out, that, went, that left in the 70s. They're looking for... Him. Beef. I consider myself an athlete. I continue to go to the gym and work out. This is, this is success. I, I think that was the right decision, and I'm happy she chose that. I want, but I let her choose it. You know, it's funny. As much as I like to dig on everybody, you don't want anything bad to happen to anybody. And Andre works his tail off, and uh, I hope his day goes well. And just as much as I hope our day goes well. Nice lineup, nice. And after a shaky morning warm up, Frank's about to find out if his horses and riders have what it takes. First up are Maria and Amigo. Not so fast, girl. They easily follow up yesterday's beautiful performance with another stellar round. <laughs> now, it's Brian and Logan's turn to prove they deserve their reputation as the best team in America. We got our plan, we'll stick with it. it it's, it's a pretty straightforward course. There's not a lot of, there's no options in it, so. Bye. After yesterday's bad round and this morning's rough warm up, the pressure is on.
Brian and Logan take the first jump with perfect style. As she guides him around a tight corner, her signals are invisible, and Logan responds without hesitation. That effortless communication between horse and rider are what Brian and Logan are known for. And to everyone's relief, the powerhouse team is back. But even with Brian and Logan seemingly back at the top of their game, for Frank, the pressure's not over. It's not as you do, though. Now, it's Chelsea's turn to make her bid for the McClay finals. I'm nervous. You can say that. Because I talked about all day how I wasn't going to be nervous, so now. Oh, God. That's what it all gets down to, guys. She didn't look very nervous, though. No, she looked good. She's very relaxed. When she's goofy like that, like when I did that face and she did it back to me, I was blown away. I was like, all right because then I know. I know in my mind, like, I have to do this and I have to try and do well because this isn't just for me. It's for the barn. It's for my trainers. It's for my family. It's for Anatello. And I'm going to try and really focus. She's ready to go. Chelsea and Mark. Chelsea and Mark. Remember we made the turn from the skinny to the triple at home? How easy was that? This is just as easy. Think of the details and you'll be fine. Huh? It's so tense in here. <laughs> I can't, the pressure I can't breathe. Chelsea's challenge is to control her nerves and guide Anatello into the perfect spot to make the jumps. But today isn't her day. Anatello hits a rail four times. There's no way Chelsea will win a ribbon. But she may still make the top 22 that pass through to the McClay finals. For Frank, it's enough hope to be worth cheering about. And for a barn mom, seeing Frank happy is all that matters. Woos identify barns, and they also identify a good round. And most importantly, you never out-woo the main wooer, who is Frank. <laughs> and you must, you must do the, the barn woo. And it has to be the barn woo. We do know the difference between the different barn woos. Woo, 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 woo. But at the end of the round, for Chelsea and the other riders, there's nothing left to do but wait and see if their road continues to the finals or ends today. Up next, the results are in.